these men will make you feel you don't know what you are doing like they will make you feel you don't know what you are doing you are not doing anything okay i normally i don't work i don't wake up on time yeah i don't wake up on time because i'm a full housewife i'm not going anywhere so i don't normally wake up on time but sometimes when my baby woke up you know when your child wake up you can't sleep you have to wake up a longer so you have you guys have to wake up the same time because this is me a father and a husband waking up regular sunday morning to dress to church checking the time sometimes i know that hey i've woken up late believe me that maybe my wife woke up on time she will get dressed on time and when i wake up because normally as a guy I do wake up and within the space of 30 minutes i already tidy myself you know brush take my bath and you know get dressed for church hoping that my woman who woke up very early must have dressed up dressed the kid and but in our home case in this house it's not like that you're gonna be wondering i just woke up and i'm saying a little prayer to god and getting myself prepared for the day today is sunday on sunday i normally wake up by seven o'clock yeah i woke up by seven o'clock and our service start by nine o'clock but we don't normally go to church by that nine o'clock sometimes we go to church by 10 10 30 10 40 yeah so guys so if i woke up on sunday morning first of all i'll take a shower do my makeup dress up after that and you guys know you as in you women you ladies you know that doing makeup like you take up to i know i don't do much this is my makeup i don't do much but at least 20 to 15 minutes or we have 20 to 15 minutes so now i got straight to the bedroom to brush my teeth meeting my wife guess what is happening she woke up by seven i'm meeting her by 10 now she's still doing her makeup hey, good morning good morning money be fast be fast time we don't have time I was like, what is going on in this house? I really don't know. This is what happened every Sunday. Like, literally every Sunday. She woke up very, uh, she woke up very early. Unfailingly, maybe 7.30. But before, sometimes she woke up before then. Not that she's in the bed, but she woke up, go straight to the bedrooms. And I don't know what happened between the space of time within the space of two hours. She's still in the bedroom. And I'll still be the one that woke up around 10 to be hurrying at her. We have late. Sometimes she say, oh women i don't know if it's all women but in my own case hmm, she always gets annoyed whenever i'm saying that oh we have laid she said oh you know i have to feed the kid i have to do this i said we just have one child what happened like one child and you have to feed her and so what have you been doing with this space of two hours guys after doing my makeup dress up i'll first of all go and wash my baby feed the bottle i'll boil hot water in flasks because we always take food to church in case she's hungry she don't normally eat at home but sometimes she eats before going to church but not every day but even when she eats i still have to take food with her because you know children are uh, like if they are hungry they will start crying and you don't need those cries so i just prefer to take food with her and after uh, washing the feed the bottle and boil hot water in the flask getting ready doing my makeup i will not go and wake my baby so i will dress my baby after that i will not go and wake this man hey <laughs> god i will not go and wake this man and this man don't do anything if he woke up brush his teeth take his shower dress up and after he dress up he just say okay i'm done when he when he's done dressing we just say okay let's go like maybe if i not tell him i'm not done yet this man will just start complaining like why are you not done yet you wake up since seven and you are still getting ready what are you not doing like i don't understand like okay i'll feed sometimes i'll have i'll have to feed my baby sometimes i will have to like do a lot of things before going to church after her set done she said i was feeding the child this is what i'm be doing you know waking up i don't have to do this and don't have to do that 
But this is me waking up around 10 and I'm still the one dressed in my shirt, putting on the shoes. Whoa. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. But men don't understand. They just believe like if you wake up, you need to be what, what would I use as an example now? Like to be a machine. Yeah, to be a machine. If you wake up, you have to do everything on time. You have to keep to time. Like they believe when they are done, you should be done with everything you are doing. Like, okay, maybe I will tell him, okay, give me an extra two minutes or a minute. Let me do this thing. This man will just start complaining, like, what have you been doing since you wake up since around seven and you have not done you are still doing things you wake up since around seven and you are still getting ready okay now it's past ten or now it's like why are you guys like this why are you guys like this like you know women can literally explain everything you know i have to bed i have to brush i have to clean i have to rub cream oh all this happened within how many hours i don't know so I'm going to be saying that this is what her passed through as a husband and as the 10th time a father. So, as you just guys are watching right now, I'm still going to be the one to finish my dressing because she woke up I'm going to be taking my bath. And I just finished brushing my teeth and taking my bath and thereafter I'm still going to dress up so that you guys will also understand that everything I'm saying now is not a lie. It's basically what is going on in the whole house. Dress. Hey guys. Mm. What's the time now? Um, I think it's ten past ten. Past ten? Yeah. Like seriously? Or to ten? No, it's already ten something. Oh. I guess. Okay. I think we're already late. What? Okay. Let Let's say it this way, guys. Okay, just imagine. If the man is the one to wake up around 7, get his baby dressed, make food for her, wash her for the bottle, will they do it like 2 minutes or uh, 3 minutes? No. Imagine, I have to do my makeup, I have to get ready, I have to get my baby ready at the same time, I have to do all those things. Like, sometimes I will clean the house so that if we are back from church, the house will look a mess. So the house will look good. You know, if you come back from church every day, work, you're just like, oh, I don't say So doing those things take time. You men need to understand that. Okay? Wait. You don't come here like this. Wait. Just put the place. I want to know the place. Yes, yeah, so exactly here. Yeah. Right, I'm okay. Okay, you ladies, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. If you are like me, that take time. I know my husband complain about that, but it's fine. Okay, okay. I'm dressed now. Let's go. I'm not ready. Let's go. You're standing in front of me. I'm not ready. I'm ready. Guys, men complain too much, but I don't know if it's all men there or, or it's just my husband. Like men will complain about everything like it's true mm. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. you come with me for sure my sister <clears throat> on the way to jacka now seriously we're not going to take her to church are we going to leave our daughter at home and go to church So guys, we are ready now. I know this man is angry, but it's fine. Doing my makeup, if I spend 10 minutes, 5 minutes, this man will start complaining. You take too much time. Why can't you just do it fast? Like, be, be fast about it. Just touch it like this and... Oh God, you know for food. <laughs> yeah. Guys, let me just do guys a quick one. The most funniest one is when I have this man to take me picture on Sunday. It, it don't normally take me picture every time. Sometimes I take my picture myself when I'm at home. I will just dress and take my picture by myself. But sometimes, especially when on Sunday like this, when we are coming back from church, I will tell him, take me picture. Hmm. This man will start complaining. 
Must you snap? Must you snap? Must you snap every Sunday? And I would not tell him. As in, I don't snap the rest days. It's only on Sunday I have time to snap. This man will start complaining. I will have to plead with him. Please. Please take me picture. Please love me. Please, please. Before he will say, oh, okay. Oh, yeah, come let me take me picture. And if you take one, he doesn't care if how you position. You know, okay. How you take stand. This man will just take the picture. Anyhow. And if you tell him, let me look at the picture. It, it will tell me everywhere is good. I'm going inside. So, as today now, he take me pictures. And the pictures, guys, like, mm, bad. <laughs> the picture not good. <laughs> I came to realize that hmm, women are photographed. I really don't know what happened. That women like pictures too much. Going to church after closing, I have to become a cameraman. Like you have to take pictures and take pictures and take pictures and take pictures. I'm gonna. I'm tired. I don't even know how to complain. You know, if you complain, it's gonna be like, <clears throat> oh, don't worry. And don't, I don't want to take pictures anymore. I don't want to take. The process you said. The moment she said, I don't want to take picture anymore, she's going to throw her face like I don't want that. This is a Sunday. It's a lovely day and it's a moment that I'm home with the family. The rest days I'm at work, I'm always busy. So, let's see what's going to happen. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Yeah. I just pretend I was taking her pictures. Then, just for you guys to I quickly have to do a quick video so that you guys see what she turns me into every Sunday. Maybe this is the reason she spent more time in the bedroom because she wants to look good because she has to take pictures. Okay, another story. You can turn around, let me see. Okay. <laughs> really the No change time. But I, as in, if I complete, will tell me it's because I agreed to take you the picture now. Don't worry, next time, whom I ask you to take you picture. <laughs> I don't know if it's just my husband or guy. I don't know if it's just my husband. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, if your husband is is the same as my husband or your husband is totally different or, or if all guys or men are the same. Let me know in the comment section because this man. He complains a lot, a lot. He complains about everything. He complains about my picture. If I take too much picture, this man will start complaining. If I don't do my makeup on time, this man will start complaining. If I'm dressing my baby, I didn't do it on time, this man will start, like. That is the basic reason why Christ did not include them in his disciples. Because I can't really believe that when Christ is saying, Oh, we have to go to Galilee. Maybe Anita is going to say, Ha, ah, I'm coming, I have to finish my makeup. <sighs> oh, oh, it's just this allergies. Uh, no, we can still meet up with the donkey to go to the Galilee. Oh, women, God, I really don't know. Ha, oh, women. Can they really do without makeup? I'm not guessing maybe it's not makeup that's making my wife to consume time on Sunday. Maybe... We're gonna be hearing from her. I'm gonna be asking questions because I demand answer. Why, man, you need answer and you want to know why your wife consumes time. If you are going to an appointment, if you're going to a place, occasion, you be the one to dress up. Maybe you be the last person to go to the bedroom, but be the first to dress up to be hurrying her. Comment below. We want to know why do women consume time like that? Solidarity forever. Solidarity forever. Oh, make sure you join me. Solidarity forever. We shall always fight for our rights. Every Sunday, we have to, like, every Sunday, I have to just be automatically. What's the word I'm looking for? Mm. Every Sunday, this man always complain because the rest days is not at home. He always go to work. So every Sunday, this man. All right, guys. So I want you guys to tell us what do you guys think about this particular videos? What do you think about this particular episode? It's going to be a regular Saturday episode for Food Time as well. What are you doing in front of my video now?
So I'm going to be pleading to hear from you guys in the comment section to tell us about your thoughts. What do you think about this particular video? So who, would you like to be seeing more of it? If yes, give us a thumbs up. If no, still give us a thumbs up. We need the thumbs up. Don't give us a thumbs down, please. Alright guys, until we meet again, peace out.